Hi everyone, this is Anna Sky, and I'm back again for another quick tutorial. This time I have the RSVP template that matches the Lovebirds template. And I just kind of want to cover a few things real quick. What you'll notice is it's just like the invitation template in that I can change all of the colors of the birds and the branches. And if I go over here to my layers panel on the right side and I expand this folder called RSVP cards, you'll see a right top, a left top, a right bottom, and a left bottom. And these correspond to the four RSVP cards on this sheet. So if I want to work on the left top, I would expand that folder and here's my artwork layer, my RSVP text, and the horizontal line. So let's say I wanted to change this instead of accepts and declines, I want to change that to receive, say yes or no. To do that, I would come over here and get my text tool, the little T, and then I come over to the A and accepts and I click. And that allows me to edit this text and I can type in yes and then no. And if I wanted to reduce the space there, I can just hit my backspace key. And at this point it's just like any other word processor. I can also come up here and change the date. So let's say my date is uh, May 12th. So I would type in May and then 12th. And if you wanted to change this font, you would simply highlight the text and then come up here to the top or to the text pa panel and pick a different font. So I could pick, at this point, I could pick, let's say, Garmond and it changes it. If I want to change the size, I can change it to 12 point and you get the idea. The other thing you can do is you can move things around. So let's say I don't want this to be left aligned for some reason, I want it to be centered. I would click with my text tool, click to the R and RSVP, highlight all of the text, and you see here is center, left aligned, and right aligned, and I would hit, simply hit center align, click the check mark to commit my changes, and now I need to move this, and to move things, you use this black arrow at the top, and you click that, and you can click and you can slide and move things. So I just wanted to cover real quick how you move things. And the last thing I'm going to show you is how to change colors again. So let's say I want to change the color of the birds in this design. I would go back over to my layer panel and I'm in the left top design, expand the artwork folder, and in the left bird, click that layer, double click color overlay. This brings up my color palette, double click the red, and now I can change this bird to be green. Click OK and OK again. So I hope this help explains a little bit more about how to use Photoshop to edit text, to move things around the page. Uh, download this template for free. Let me know how you like it and comment in the box below. Thanks and I'll talk to you next time.